Middle East then. Something with Jerusalem and Snape. Um, well, you mean uh, what? Uh, when the Crusaders took over Jerusalem and now they need to defend it? Oh, the name of the mod. I got it. I'll check it out anyway. Do need to check out, like, a. Uh, make a book bookmark folder with all the mods I want to play. Then just open it up every now and then to see if they're updated or out yet. Yeah, I'm gonna check it out. I'm probably not gonna play it yet. Probably gonna play the Tessagin mod next. No, 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 no. What the, what the f... Okay, fuck you, game. We're gonna be like that. We're we gonna auto-resolve. We're gonna... Let's let them all go so they like us. Except these. Imagine Crusader uh, campaign on our channel. Well, we, we could do it at some point. I think I'm gonna need to level up the troops a little bit more. So let's grab everything. I'm probably gonna do like a lot of shorter campaigns. So the idea here is gonna be just to take over the Nor Northern Empire or like, you know, dethrone Ragnar, basically. Nothing, nothing else. It's gonna be easy enough. Maybe like take out the Batanians or so. Ooh, we're actually over our hands. I need more mules. I need a bigger baggage train. But re recruiting troops now is gonna be a pain in the ass. Definitely. I'm actually surprised we didn't lose anything yet. Yeah, I do have Italian troops. I do have their fians and a lot of them. 68 of them. They're pretty decent. I do find the crossbowmen, a little of a landing crossbowmen or sharpshooters a bit more a pain in the ass than Batanian Fians to be honest. Because uh because I have the realistic battle mod on. So for some reason the AI splits up the uh Batanian Fians into a separate group and like place them behind the infantry not as an archer group but like behind the infantry like a you know a double up because they're infantry as well yeah though come on destroy the walls see that we can open this up and like see if there's a like another army somewhere formed. Because I don't want to leave them to defend that area because uh, otherwise they're gonna lose all of it instantly if no one's defending it. One 
bridge up here, other one down there. These guys up there, like I thought we could. Come on, ain't fair. Okay, since I can't get the arch stand in front, let's just charge in. Don't fall off the fucking battlefield. Got three skill points in riding from throwing an axe at the enemy. I do love how the experience works in this. Makes so much sense. One of those rooms. This is nice to like see the, all the arrows and javelins and axes like bounce off the walls when they when the infantry throws them. Rogers. Four of them left. Somewhere. No, we don't want a Valkyrie. Right, we need a battalion here. Well, let's take all of this. We can place it in garrison. Now, how exactly is this going to work? If I dec decline this, it's because... We don't have a like, kingdom screen. Oh, it's... Oh, it's automatically mine, never mind. Wait, can we... We can only assign the governor. Assign him. To all towns, god damn it. And plate. Oh, that's gonna be fine. Something like 
bunch of money in here though. And this was utterly, utterly wrecked. Now, we'll be a good idea to let these guys recruit a little bit. Strangely enough, nothing over here is besieged, which is uh, amazing. I am mean, going to need to rec recruit anything I can get my hands on at this point. Well, look at that, we can actually make an army. Interesting. Or our companions can, or, you know, kingdom vassals can, even though we're uh, one mercenary scale. But watch for mercenaries in this game. Okay, they pissed out the Valandians, but they're in war with the Batanians. That could actually work out for us. If they actually went and besieged that instead of us, I could make a deal with that. No, no. Not gonna bother. Oh, never mind. We can't actually. Floki. Floki is on our side. That means we're gonna win, definitely. We stay true to the old gods. Okay, let me see. You have one. You have one. Let's give one to him. Apparently we can crew. Look at that. We can actually... This guy doesn't really love me, neither does he. He hates me, he hates me. <laughs> he doesn't really like me. Okay, so only the Northern, only Lucan is like meh about us. We actually have more strength than them. Which is odd. Alive was the main strength in the in the party, right? So it makes a little bit of sense. Yeah, let's call in the rest of the. They didn't recruit almost anything, but uh, grab this as well. Sixty-seven defenders, though. Let's go grab the castle first. Might be able to like grab a couple of. No, never mind, it's being taken already. Maybe. Yeah, this is what I meant. Maybe the battalion sell us a little. Take some of their stuff. They're going to a point. Always nice to see. gonna be a bit easier to break down the walls here since there's one almost depleted all the way
Yeah, go, go after them. Kill them. There's so many fucking mercenaries on my ass, it's unbelievable. believable They're gonna attack me, are they? Yep. I'm gonna be fucking surprised if they don't, actually. Probably gonna get attacked here or not for sure. Like there's too many of them. Like not do it. The game looks so nice in slow mo- well, normal speed, not slow motion. I do wish some battalions forces like came through here and- oh god. Of course the AI's, AI's always gonna focus you down no matter what. We're at war with three factions, or two factions, doesn't matter. Let's go for this guy. We're losing shit left and right, let's go for this guy. I'm gonna make them stay in shield wall though. What the fuck am I stuck on? Because the idea here is gonna be to make this sit in the castle. Hopefully, they're gonna run away. So their army, like, there's only their army on the field. We don't have to fight their army, plus the all the rabble that's gathered around us, all the mercenaries. Which I still don't know how you can actually recruit to this day. Berserkers are going in already. This fucking kill field. Hmm. I don't wonder what's gonna happen if I like get those ladders up. If the, is the infantry gonna split up into two formations? See what happens. Apparently nothing. No, uh, some of them are going this way. Maybe we can trick the AI a little bit this way. Apparently we cannot. The weapon is fish weapon because I have no fucking clue why the shield doesn't work.
What the fuck was that throw, man? Here is there? Nope. Yeah, now if all the mercenaries ran off, we could actually like uh, beat the army that's coming at us. We didn't lose too many here. Or oh, that's the idea. Let's see what happens. Let's actually start taking them prisoner. Grab all of those. Actually show mercy. No, I'm not gonna take it for myself. Can we actually talk to him? Like, no, no, no. He needs to be in your guest, in your uh, like troop tree. See what happens now. What the AI does. They're going to besiege the other castle. Over there, it seems. Or it. Never mind, it does seem like they pieced out. Motherfuckers. How the hell did they piece them out so quick? Do we wanna give it to Floki? Alright, oh, right, never mind. Let me let's give it to him. Let's see if we can give our companions. Wait to me, like if we can still enter this. Hmm. Yeah, the game should have saved once we finish that battle. So let's see what happens when you click this. You m morons. Shit. Right, let's... Uh, got that. It should be in the keep if you go to the keep, I think. Yep, they are. Okay, I'm not sure about that guy. I'm sure about him. Wait a minute. How the fuck does one get over there? Well, this is a bit unfucking necessary.
Okay. Should reward you for his service. He was the first one, so we're gonna give him. I can't remember which is which. We're gonna keep the capital here and say on. on. We're gonna give him. Never mind, we're not gonna give him anything. <laughs> I forgot you need to have a shitload of influence for that. Okay, so a good thing would be to catch that army alone without any of these. Mercenaries around. The problem is. I was thinking they were gonna like besiege that on their own. Apparently they are too dumb. Yeah, they didn't even fucking care. Now they care. Actually, actually, yeah, let's see. Let's see if we can... Right, my um, charm ain't up to scrap anyway, so... Yeah, there's no way we're gonna persuade anyone over anything. Do old number him. Why they didn't? Why they didn't spawn right in front of us this time? what they're shooting at but I'm fine with it. Okay, there's gonna, not gonna be any reinforcements so let's charge in. Move towards them. We only got 40 archers. So we should be. F I have eight more infantry than us, so, but we should be fine. Stop somewhere, guys. Like, that's the hill they're gonna die on. What? This is gonna be it. We're gonna move up. With the infantry there, then move up the archers as well. Our cow should beat theirs anyway. Kind of. Should. Should. Our archers should be theirs, actually, as well. Do have a lot more of them. I'm actually debating on whether or not I capture him or not. Might be a good idea to actually capture him and then hold him prisoner. I'm 
I'm pretty sure we can't actually make him. Never mind, we can. I think the AI is a little bit smarter than that with the mod on. But they're not gonna like just charge into us. What's my cab doing inside of him? for the infantry. How the fuck did that hit the shield? Look at that, only 12 losses. On the hardest difficulties as well. Just got to manipulate the AI. And all goes to plan. So many companions, man. Nine upgrades. Then the three, not nine. Group limit. Seems I recruited a random companion again. Or not? What's up, enemy? What the hell am I? What? Thanks, man. Glad you enjoy it. Uh, I got no clue. Okay, now. That's gonna be a problem. We're not gonna be able to dump them in there. But they might run away. Okay, all of these are companions, so we should be good. The Lord should still be in the party. Let's ban these guys real quick. What's the other army doing? Cocktailer. Is it Serbian or not? I know it's Cyrillic. I know that much. No, I'm, I'm not Russian, though. Or, yeah, well. Other, other Cyrillic language. I am Serbian, though. These guys are just patrolling around. How about you come over here and take something? AI is useless. Maybe I should have just called them into my party, right? But they're so... F yeah, that's, that was the problem. Like, uh, we're so spread out. I, like, have this here. Then we have, like, the other guys over here. I 
I'm gonna need to bring them over so we can actually take all of this. Right, let's try and get over there so we can dump the prisoners in. This nice, still has some issues, but should be they should be fixed, hopefully in the next year. Well, this year. This game is online. Uh, it, it does have like Benelode online, the mod where you can play with. Uh, I think th there are no lords in that version. There are only players. Of garrison. Uh, dungeon. Drop all of them in. Let's steal a couple of troops from the garrison. Like the higher tier ones. Now the multiplayer is not half bad either for this for this game. I played a little bit of it. But like I'm no match versus the people who actually, you know, play it every day. I just get wrecked. The Battalion Hero, grab them as well. Pagan. Pagans. interesting to see the modded version of the game actually like get modded as well like the battle lord online mod with a thousand players or however many you can get in there five uh, five hundred i think the, i think i saw the player limit at 500 for like a eastern european server uh i have the same thing but just uh with a mod on like this, for example, or Eagle Rising, or you know, Total Ver Conversion Mod, or something like that. That would be pretty interesting. So a lot of people control the Romans with uh, That may have been what we needed, right? A shitload of mules. Still have a shitload of food. Is it gonna actually... I'm actually surprised it's not slowing us down yet. Right, this might be an issue. Need to set up their recruiting a little bit differently. Yeah, let's just do that. Just let them recruit whatever, because um, at this point we don't have a really uh, a lot of choice. We need to catch up to him. There's no point fighting this one. So we can sell it. But that's experience still. Now nah, let's get some experience.
Let's dump the prisoners in there. Now, I'm not sure what's gonna happen if we get the war exhaustion up to 100 on them. They might just uh, declare peace. Which I guess we'll see what happens then. Yeah, they need to let them recruit a little bit. They have a bigger army. They're actually besieging Tokor Castle. Yeah, they're actually doing something, but I don't think they're gonna make it till the, till over there. Casualties. Would be nice if, like, it told me how many the war exhaustion rate. Good intelligence. The AI does. It ain't smart. No way. Not yet, anyway. Can we persuade Ragnar's wife to join us? Would be fucking funny. Hmm. Might be an idea to. Yeah, might be actually a better idea to like grab all of this stuff first. There's one, two, three, four. The only four. City. Well, there's less here, but uh, I think it's gonna be easier to take this. Game, I clicked on Ragnar. Follow Ragnar. Come on. I don't wonder what's going to happen if I cut off his head. I mean, it's just going to be a replace, but, you know. Still. Is supposed to be standard barrel. Now, yeah, I think we're going to need to move towards them. Well, AI is a little bit smarter than Warband, I guess. Just a tiny bit. Just charging. Oh my god, he has a fucking pike. And I just one hit killed him. That was a little bit anticlimactic. Oh, he did get shot, I guess. Yeah, the shit talk have, and then they actually do something. 
And zero losses as well. Yeah, this is going quite smoothly, I'd say so. Let's go dump this. Oh, we should like leave the king in some like better, better defended town. like taking the king out to would they like give you like more war exhaustion or something so you can make a piece it easier look at that she has no way i think she's gonna still uh no we're actually faster than her catch her come on Get the king, get the wife, or the queen. Well, I guess, uh, wait, not. I didn't actually check if the, if is uh, Lagertha the queen or is the other one the queen. Whatever the fucking name it was. Or the other, second wife of Ragnar in the show. It's been a while since I watched it. What's your problem? Oh, this is good. It looks like they only have recruits on them. Not like higher tier infantry and everything. Two hundred. It took him for fucking hour to get there and actually besiege it. Let's see. Did, they got, did these guys get some recruits in? Kind of, not really. Let's give him a little bit more time and scout out how many troops all of these have. Snowy. Okay, we're not gonna catch him, that's for sure. Yeah, no, 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 no freaking way. Oh shit. Well, that's fucking bad. All the guys from our faction are now in their prison. Oh, you fucked up. Never mind, that's a mercenary. Only one loss on our side. So this has about 300 troops in it. And 
This has 400 without the parties in there, to be honest. Now, it would be nice if they actually, like, gathered an army and attacked something. Could be an, it would be an easier way to take him out. Like, chase him down, each one of them. Guys like this, it's gonna take a while. The game could have spawned him a little bit further away from me. Never mind, they're charging in. They got no terrain advantage, I guess. Archers, move! Archers, move! Footmen, move! Oh yeah, their parties are super low tier. Except for the Valkyries, I guess. The only thing the cab does in this game is run away. Even, even with the mod that like makes them uh, recruit less troops, they still recruit a bunch really freaking fast. And our uh, vassals losing troops to freaking uh, bandit parties. Or apparently they didn't take any of them prisoner. Okay, let's form up army. The idea is gonna be to like make them 
attack us. Or stop us besieging something. I'm attempting to go all the way over here. It's only 9k, let's grab that stuff. Yeah, let's wait here to gather up the troops. already escaped. Nice to see. Okay, this only has 420. Never mind. Oh, it has a party of 100 people in there. Nice. Ivar is there too. The boneless. Oh no. What shall we do? Guess we'll kill him as well. I guess the only good thing is when you actually like get attacked while besieging an enemy. They don't actually like uh, or their like other force doesn't actually like leave the city to attack you. Imagine if it's like that like in Realm or in any Total War game. Well, that would be a fucking pain in the ass. Okay, here's hoping the AI takes the bait and attacks us here. doesn't go off besieging something or even if there are a lot of them gather up here I could stop the siege let one of the guys in the army go and he should like gather them all up at least that's the idea Actually, we don't want to fuck with the morale at this point. It's something like that. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. This might be... Of course they're gonna have more troops than me, what did I think? The problem here is they have a bunch of small parties that they can't drag the other ones in. 